Hi, welcome to AFTV. I've got Robbie with me. <sighs> Last one's kind of it's cold out here, but 6 0 to the Arsenal. They warmed me up in today's performance. What a performance from the boys today, Robbie. It's, it's looking good. Top of Premier League, top of the Champions League group. And, you know, we're through, man. Yeah, outstanding performance today. Um, top of the group, qualified already, going to that last game mm. against PSV. Not even to, remember, if we say we lost tonight, we'd have to go away to PSV where we lost last year. Yeah. Remember, in Europa League, having to win a game or draw a game. Mm. All that's gone now, all that anxiety, potential anxiety is <laughs> gone. We won the group. You know, that last game now, we, we can send kids out there if we want to. Yeah, yeah. You know, I don't think he will. I think he will still send a half-decent team out there for the integrity of the competition. But our job is done. We've topped the group. We've been brilliant. We've destroyed teams here in the Champions League. I know, I know that, you know, there's going to be much tougher teams that are going to come here. But, you know, we've been very impressive in this competition at home. Mm. Six against these guys tonight. What was it, Sevilla? That was four, four against them. No, four against PSV. PSV sorry, yeah. And what, Sevilla, Sevilla like two, two, three? Two, I think it's, yeah. Clean sheets. I mean, what more can you ask for? I mean, it was the only blip was the, the game over there in Lons. Yeah. And really and truly, I mean, yeah, they deserve to win on the nine, but we did miss a lot of chances yeah, in that did. game as well. We did. So we've been good in the Champions League and it bodes well. When you play well at home in the Champions League and when you don't concede a lot of goals, when you're keeping clean sheets... It, both in the Premier League and here, that bodes well for the future because that's the sort of thing that helps you to win, particularly in cup competitions mm. when you don't concede. So I thought today was excellent Havertz again. Has, it, has he landed? Because you know when he, he scored his goal against Brentford, the big question was, but can he do it consistently? Well, it can, can, he, can, he, can he go on from here? Is it just a, a one-off wonder when it comes to sure, coming? He's shown tonight. Yeah, he can. He's yeah. the, the very next game he scores and that's an important goal. That goal the first goal of the game that gets us, you know, oh, yeah. off the mark. Those goals are so important in, when you're playing in competitions like this. You know what I mean? It can be tight affairs. It can be Cajun affairs. Remember, we're playing against a team that beat us last time. Yeah, true. Right? So that goal is important. So he scored in the last two games now, he scored two very, goals. very important goals. And that bodes well for the future. He's got to keep it going. There was a fan who said it earlier. He's going to have to be consistent with it. Yeah. But... He's definitely turned a corner, you know what I mean? And, you know, yeah. I, I, I'm, how, I'm, how much so, though, Robert? Has he, has he edged out Trossard into that role? Because everyone, when no, I did I it... I don't think he's edged out Trossard. I think, he, listen, there's competition for places. This is what, again, this is what yeah. we want to see. We've got a good squad. When everybody's fit, when you look at that squad, it's, mad. it's a good squad, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? I, I, I just looking at it the other day, and I, I, I think we was doing a starting eleven, and I said, if everyone was fit, including oh, go, Partey yeah. and Timber, what would your eleven be? It's a very hard thing to do. Yeah. So, I think it's great that this competition is here. It could be that the weekend comes and maybe Trossard is back in the team, but that's what we want. We want a strong squad. That's what City have had for years. You know what I mean? And even Liverpool have had that, you know, where they've got a good, you know, replacements. If Robertson's out, yeah. Simicast comes in. If, you know, this is the sort of thing that we needed at Arsenal and we're starting to get that. So, yeah, I, I was really impressed with the performance tonight. I mean, we just breezed them aside. Why was that though? Did Arsenal's underestimate from what they, just, you know, when we played them at their place, they underestimate us? Or was it just the fact that we just are now starting to find a rhythm? Did they, they didn't really double up on Saka. There were so many yeah, things. Listen, that this I couldn't believe how they, listen, yeah. I think maybe they were carried away with the first game, yeah, right? Yeah, they, well, they came and they were playing a really high line and they come to attack. attack yeah. And I think they haven't read the script, man. When you come <laughs> here, you come to attack, you're going to get destroyed. Yeah. I think similar to what some people were saying earlier, which is very true, is that teams that are coming here in the Premier League or even teams you play, you Brentford at the weekend, right? Brentford know that if they come and attack like that, they'll get destroyed as well. Yeah. So they deploy another tactic. They go a lot deeper, they, a low block, and they try and capitalise on any mistakes that Arsenal made. It nearly worked mm. when, you know, Ramsdale made that error, mm. right? But they came just like, you know, I think Sevilla sort of did that PSV. Yeah. They come in maybe because, and I think maybe the mentality is that you're playing against teams that are champions of their leagues or they're, they're runners up, you know, in their league. They did well in their leagues yeah. last year. Yeah, they did. So not, not used to deploying low blocks and that. They come in and they say, that's, a good, we're, that's a very good point. You know, we're Sevilla or we're PSV and yeah. you know what I mean? And then when they're coming here now, they're realising that if you do come here and you deploy that, 
Sometimes. against a very, very good Arsenal team that are good at attacking, you'll get destroyed. Whereas yeah. in the league, I think teams are coming here and they are very weary of Arsenal. They yeah. they saw what Arsenal did last year to teams if you went to gun ho. Yeah. So they come into the, particularly to the Emirates. They're very, very weary, even away from home. Yeah, yeah. Even yeah. away from home, you're playing teams, they're very weary. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right. So, you know, I, I, I think that, you know, maybe that was a mistake of, of Lons tonight. Definitely. They've come and they thought that, you know, they can come on the attack and, yo, you it's, can't. See what you can't hear. You know what I mean? You're up against a, a very, very good side, solid defensively, great in the midfield and attacking wise, we got weapons. Out of the six, Rob, who, what was your favourite? Oof. Do you know what I like that? I like the I like the Jesus Jesus one where flee. yeah, he's he done that again. He's, yeah. he's done that a few times this competition. Where he left, just left Dallow sliding floor. before in the Premier he, League. He's as looking well. great in this competition. Yeah. I, I like that goal. I did like that all the guard finish as well, but I like that goal. Uh, there was so many good, go good the goals. The Martinelli one as well. As soon as he yeah, cut in on that, yeah. you know, he's, he's starting to get that sort of Iron Robin thing. And as yeah. soon as he cuts yep. in on that thing, bang, you know. So nah, there was some great goals scored today. Um, I thought their goalkeeper was at fault for a couple, but there were some great goals scored. But I think the Jesus one, I really like that, man. He's such a skillful oh. player. He really is. Um, and people keep saying, oh, well, he don't score enough goals. He scored a lot of goals so far in this competition. Yep. He's done all right in the Premier League. He's just been injured. Yeah. To see if Sky can get the injury thing sorted out and we can get a full season out of Jesus, then let's see if he can score mm. 20. I reckon he can. Just off the back of that, quickly before we wrap up, like six different goal scorers. Like, is that a thing to look at as well, Robbie? Because yeah, that's people nice. people keep saying, yeah, Jesus needs to score, he needs to score. We need to maybe look at getting a striker in January. I understand that, but six different goal scorers is a good achievement, especially in Champions League. No, that's League. nice. Listen, they're sharing the goals around. You know what I mean? It's great to see Martin Odegaard back on the score sheet. And there's a lot of goals in that team. You know what I mean? If they get chances, there's a lot of goals in that team, in that squad, you know what I mean? We know Trossard can come and score a goal. Yeah, Jesus, Jesus, yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? So there's a, he, and, and I, I truly believe Jesus, if he stayed fit for a season, he can score the 20. A lot of people come on and say, he can't, yeah. he ain't gonna give you 20 goals at the moment, only because he gets injured. True. But last year, was it 15? Yeah, and he, just under 50, yeah. Yeah, and he was oh, out. Comps, yeah. And he was out for three months. Mm. Yeah. So why can't he score 15 in a season? I, I like to see him just stay fit because he's a very, very good player. And I think we can go far in this competition. It, obviously, it all depends on the luck of the draw. Yeah. You know what I mean? I mean, even I was looking through the draw, potential draw and some of the teams that we could face in the next round. And even that's not easy. We could get Napoli. We could get Inter Milan. Yeah. You know, we could get PSG if they finish runners up in their group. You know what I mean? Not looking as great PSG as so far though, but still but it, it's and, and, and Mbappe. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, it's not it's not an easy yeah, even yeah. even getting the runners up. You know what I mean? You got it's very hard to just say, yeah, we're gonna go all the way yeah. to the semi final because you don't know who you're gonna get. But certainly, I do think think this team is definitely equipped to go far in this competition because. I think if you can defend well, which we've been showing all season, I think you can go far in a competition. Um, but all they're going to depend on we're going. But listen, so far, so good, man. We're through. We're United, through. are you through? Oh. No. Oh. <laughs>